guys, I prepared a different episode for today in tune with the Halloween day. And I choose a strong topic which is focused on two types of women you should never ever date or taking as friend. And if you recognize one to know how to deal with. Let's dive in. Psychopathy is defined as a mental antisocial disorder in which an individual manifests a moral and antisocial behavior, shows a lack of ability to love or establish meaningful personal relationships, expresses extreme egocentricity, and demonstrates a failure to learn from experience and other behaviors associated with the condition. With that in mind, yes, males are predominant in this category, but women who know how to hide their emotions could be your next date, and who knows, maybe you're in love with a future Harley Quinn one with psychopath behaving. That's why you gotta pay close attention to these facts. If she's irresponsible, meaning that she doesn't care if she hurts you or your feelings, but she admits that, or she's cheating you, but she doesn't have any kind of remorse. Pay attention if she took something from you without to blink an eye, or she decides to steal something, or she's involved in money laundering, or she's driving super fast without to think of consequences. This is a strong point and you need to be aware because in those moments or in some situation, her dark side from her mind will be reflected in her behavior. Example, she starts to be violent verbally and physically she might have some scars on her body that will talk about her past as being a violent woman. This is correlate with the point C. She will show zero emotion after she cheats or if she was violent with you. She can uh, empathy with you because that part from her mind, thoughts, are missing. We already know that vast majority of women are experts when it comes about lying. She's got moments when the words do not align to the deeds. Harley Quinn type of women are manipulative and they like to hurt others. When she can control some situations to be in her favor, especially in a relationship, she will start to manipulate you, facts, people around you, and for example, you decide to break up with her, she will start to make you to pay for your decision by hurting you and your future partner or people who are close to you. She has a lot of fines unpaid she has addiction for firearms or fines for using firearms without a gun license. She's a single mom and she let her child or child in your charge. Or she goes extreme drinking too much, smoking or taking drugs. Or, and this is super, super important, she's addicted to first-person shooter games. Harley Quinn type of women could bring you down, man, especially if you're not that uh, joker type. So, conclusion, stay away from her. According to health.com, when you think of sociopath, you probably picture Christian Bale in American Psycho or Anthony Hopkins in Silence of the Lambs. But like most mental health conditions, sociopathy or antisocial personality disorder, you know, people with ASP tend to be deceitful and impulsive. Perhaps one of the most well-known 
sign of ASP is a lack of empathy. Sociopaths are not only hostile themselves, but they are more like to interpret others' behavior as hostile, which drives them to seek revenge. Some might be openly violent and aggressive. Others will cut you down verbally. People with ASP tend to show a, a cruel disregard for other people's feelings. Now picture all this in a woman, the Freddy Krueger type female version. See, women don't walk on the street having a, a, a banner, you know, with a personality above their head. And when a female sociopath first meets you, they are on a mission to collect as much information about you as possible. She will play to your sympathy and pity by pretending she has similar life experience as you. She will claim she has similar interests, hobbies, passions, you know, life goals and value which in fact is just a facade. It, this is a huge red flag, man. They are sadistic and enjoy inflicting pain. Female sociopath, you know, the Freddy Krueger ones, they enjoy seeing people squirm just for the hell of it. They thrive off of male attention or female attention. You know, Female predators are not opposed to using their bodies to get what they want. They have no qualms using their appearance and sexuality. You know, looks outstanding, no? Now, if you want to go on a search to see yourself, for example, to check who's Jody Arias and what some women are, as men with ASP are capable. You know, all this looks creepy it does for sure in a halloween day that's why eyes wide shut when you go to pick up a stranger one you know the freddy krueger ones are dangerous for real i'm lucian and this was the special episode for halloween click the like button and subscribe if you enjoy it and i'll see you soon